case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 2007 case, Patrick Longben sued Robin Schoenrock for defamation after she called him Pat the Pedophile. Longben, a former police officer, claimed that this defamatory name contributed to his termination from his job. A jury initially found Schoenrock guilty of defamation, but the district court reversed the decision. Longben appealed, arguing that the district court had made multiple errors. Upon review, the Minnesota Court of Appeals found that calling someone a pedophile is indeed defamatory per se, and the district court had made errors in its judgment. Factors leading up to the development of the case included Long Ben's relationship with an 18-year-old woman and a cell phone conversation between Schoen Rock and a man named Wilson, who claimed that he intended to contact various law enforcement agencies regarding Long Ben. The Court of Appeals remanded the case for further proceedings and determined that a new trial should be held for general damages. The decision on special and punitive damages, however, was affirmed. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.